The FDA set new guidelines last month that require mammogram providers uh, to notify women if they have dense breast tissue and recommend that they talk with a doctor if more screening is needed. So to be clear, half of women 40 or older have dense breasts and that means they have up to four times a greater chance of getting breast cancer. Tonight in our Buddy Check 3 report, we help you understand breast density and the new recommendations. In 2020, at 37, Erin Lamb felt a lump in her breast. A mammogram caught her cancer early, stage one. The mammographer and breast stenographer at St. Joseph's Candler has a family history of the disease. I do have dense breast tissue. I have been called back um, a few times due to the dense breast tissue. Dr. Jordan Dixon, director of women's imaging at Telfair, says about 40% of women have dense breast tissue. Here's an example of a fatty density breast. And the white, which you can see, is not taking up most of the breast um, on this lady, um, is the fibroglandular tissue. So she would be considered a fatty uh, breast mm -hmm. density, which does not hide the cancer. Now, here's a look at a dense breast. You can see that the white is the fibroglandular tissue, and that is taking up much greater of a um, part of her breast tissue as opposed to the gray, which is the fat that we all have in our breast. Um, and so the white could camouflage a cancer if there were a cancer hiding in there. Women with dense breasts have four times greater chance of getting breast cancer. It's terrifying when women think they're getting the best test for them and they're okay till the next year. And that just may not be the case if they have that dense tissue hiding that. So in March, the FDA mandated a new nationwide standard of notifying women of their breast density. Georgia and South Carolina have been following the guidelines since 2016. Um, and this law states that when a woman receives the mammogram, she has to be notified that she has dense breast tissue. Erin says she clearly understands the FDA's ruling. It will help women stay informed about their health. You know, with the new FDA regulations, so that way you can keep track of your appointments, check your breasts, you can know and know for your future children, grandchildren, if they need, you know, to take extra precautions for that. Women with dense breasts are encouraged to talk to their doctor and ask if they need additional screening like an ultrasound or MRI. The new FDA standards take effect in 2024. All right, so here's